debate, presidential candidate Dennis Kucinich said he'd seen one, so has Jimmy Carter. So did a pilot who traveled from Iran to Washington so he could speak out today about his encounter with the UFO. Now, unidentified flying object means just that, unidentified. It says nothing about what or from where. But for years now, polling has shown that a majority of Americans believe the government, our government, simply isn't telling all it knows about those lights in the sky, whatever they are. Well, tonight, CNN's Gary Tuckman investigates. If you flew on Air France from Nice to London on January 28, 1994, your captain says he saw a UFO 1,000 feet long just outside your window. It seemed to be a huge flying disc. The now retired pilot is one of 14 men, mainly former government and military officials from seven different countries, talking about their UFO experiences. It disappeared in about 10 to 20 seconds. This conference took place in Washington, and the cast of characters was almost strangely, well, conventional. One of the believers, former governor of Arizona, Fife Symington. I saw something that defied logic and challenged my reality. During a visit to Phoenix, Symington described to me what he saw. If you, if you had been here 10 years ago and standing out here and looking up there at the, um, at the lights and the view, um, you would have been astounded. You would have been amazed. The so-called Phoenix light.